receive a cable connection for last three months, but I didn't get connected that connection. What the hell are you doing here? I understand your problem, but there is a there has been a problem in our wiring. We are uh, we are uh, you know uh, trying to uh, trying to sort it out, and, and your cable will be connected as soon as possible. You are running a company like that, but you are have not cable connection like that. You should be. I know, I know. I feel your pain about it, but but you know you have to understand. We know that you are uh, paying your uh, money, and uh, we care, we care you, we care for your uh, problem. Excellent. But uh, but you have to, you know, you have to understand our problem also, and uh, we apologize to you. The kisi ko gussa hota hai. You probably noticed in summer everybody is angry at someone else, and then on top of it, we're fasting as well. So you can just imagine how angry we can get. So um, yeah, anger management. And then the word that she used, we apologize. So what? मतलब आप अगर किसी को कह देते हैं we apologize, उससे आप छोटे नहीं होंगे। आपने बहुत दफा सुना होगा, लेकिन कभी apply करके देखी, किसी को forgive करके देखी, आपको एहसास होगा कि आप खुद you feel better yourself. And I have actually experienced it myself recently, and I want to share it with you guys. Uh, I was um, angry at someone, and I don't get angry very easily. And this was this is this was my friend from childhood. So she did something which was very small. It, I didn't really need to get angry, but because I'm so close to her, so it hurt me a lot. And uh, I was like, you know, I was praying and I couldn't focus on my prayer and I was like, I remembered that Allah means us, that you're supposed to forgive and if you forgive me, there's nothing like it, you know. So I was like, Allah means us, that means my heart is broken and I will forgive you, I will do something, I will do something, I will do something, I will do something, right? So when I forgave her, then I forgave her for Allah, I will do something. And I should feel the weight lifting off my shoulders and my head. It was for my own sanity. And then I understood. I was like, oh wow, I had no idea. So we tend to question a lot of things, but in the end, of course, God knows us better. So sometimes it's good to talk about these emotions. It's good to forgive people. It's also good to not be hot with it. Right? So let's have our second group of participants. Let's see what they've prepared. What issues you are facing now? There are some issues I'm dealing with right now. Some guide on money taking. So I just need to give you more time. Please stop your time. Okay, then take some time and try to complete this task because I have given you this task one week ago. So take your time. And if you face any kind of problem, you can directly call me. Thank you so much, ma'am. I'm trying my best to complete it as soon as possible. No wonder, no wonder he doesn't do what she tells her, tells him to do, because she's so gentle, she's so soft-spoken, and if you're a boss, that can go against you also. So sometimes it's important to be assertive. And what assertive means that you get your work done, uh, but with integrity. But firmly, So if you need something done, you have to make that serious face and tell the other person that you need business. Otherwise, people will take you for granted. You know, you ask me koi baat nahi ये थोड़ी सी भी फीलिंग आ जाए, आप सुन सो, आप खुद ही अपने आप को एनालाइज करो और सोचो कि अगर आपके टीचर आपको नॉन सीरियस तरीके से हंसते हंसते कोई चीज करेगी, अच्छा कल अपनी सब बुक्स लेकर आना, तो कितने बच्चे लेकर आएं? नो वन, लेकिन अगर आपके टीचर कहेगी, अगर आप बुक नहीं लाएंगे तो आप क्लास so you have to give them incentives, you know, and this has been going on for generations. It's not just you guys, but you need incentives. Okay, moving on. Signs of high intelligence. 
uh, emotional intelligence. You need to handle criticism without denial, without excuse, without blame. That's what the Japanese do, you know. The Japanese, they do not blame each other. Uh, so if you ever go to Japan, you'll never see people fighting because they want to save face, you know. It's kind of the opposite. They're, in the Pakistani culture, we tend to blame other for something. So it's a good idea to stop blaming people because uh, when you stop blaming people, then you start thinking what went wrong and how can I do better. And that's when the game changes. That's when people start to progress. That's when societies progress. And you've seen the example. Why did I give you the example of Japan? Because that's a country that has progressed. So, ऐसे randomly लोग progress नहीं करते हैं. वो उनकी society से कुछ characteristics होते हैं, जिसको वो value करते हैं. और based on that, the societies form. So integrity, सच्चाई को value देते हैं. And वो उसको जो आपकी society जिस में collectivism होता है. कि वो आपस में एक दूसरे का ध्यान रखते हैं। It's not about I, 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 me, myself and I. No, then you give credit to other people as well. If you work in a group, the right thing to do is to give credit to your uh, group mates as well. Alright, um, moving on. I just have a few examples where uh, you might come across. Uh, you know, when you're working, you might have a system that crashes and of course you want to say things that I can't say here right now, but keep your calm, start again. Uh, if you get a late email from your boss, you know, you will get a lot of things in your life, you will get a lot of things in your life, you will get a lot of things in your life, you will get a lot of things in your life, and you will have to move past them in order to become a better person. Uh, but the most important Okay, I just want to show you this picture as well. I can't end my talk without showing this picture to you. Who is more likely to succeed? Leader who screams at his team or leader who stays calm and assesses the situation and then uh, is assertive as well. Okay? The leader knows when to say no and then stick to it. So, um, the most important thing of today's talk that I haven't mentioned in any of the slides is persistence. So, I hope you guys know what persistence means. You can be intelligent and you can have all A stars, but if you don't have persistence, if you're not emotionally persistent, then you cannot get anywhere. And I have seen people, I have seen classmates who were just average students, but they were dedicated. So in their personality, I see. The Parhain is bilkul average today, not toppers. They can dedicate it. They kept on working hard and Scotland said PhD curly or a teens when they and what not. Because it was smart me the 100% marks me late, the 50% late, the back benches be also the turn was it. They came from the personality as a team. They knew how to interact with the right people in the right way at the right time and Continue doing that. So persistence is what I want you to uh, just uh, keep in mind and continue doing it. I'll leave you with these handouts. They're emotional and social skills. Please judge yourself. Uh, do answer them. You will discover a lot of things about yourself. And when you see that there's room for improvement, uh, please start working on that. Thank you so much. Dear ma'am, thank you very much for conducting such a wonderful and great workshop with our students. And I hope they have learned a lot. In the end, I would like to request Ms. Hirai Raj and Ms. Kintarshwar to please present souvenir and to get to our worthy guest speaker.